your appointment's here. Oh, hey. Hey, how are you doing? Thank you. I'm fine. How are you? Thanks for taking Good. some time to see me today. Absolutely. Absolutely. Can I get so a So what tour? are we doing? Yeah. Come All on. Right. Let's go. I want to see a tour of these new offices. What's conference room? Very nice. How are you feeling today? I feel good. You look all Valentine's Day. Yeah, I had to do a TV thing this morning. So, so what does your schedule look on a normal day? It's different every day. Just I look at it and say, okay, that's going to be an interesting day. Let's do it. Do you have any plans for the weekend? Are you going to celebrate Valentine's this weekend? Probably work. Oh. So, um, how long have you been in these offices? We've been here since about June. So this is our collaborative area. So very nice. Wow, this yeah. is gorgeous. Yeah, we love it. Lots of fun things go on in here, so. So where did you grow up? Pensacola. What do you miss most about Pensacola? The beach. <laughs> uh, what can you not leave home without? My phone. All right, I can, I can see that. Best piece of advice that anyone has uh, given you? To be myself. So if you're on your phone all the time, what's your most used emoji? Uh, the one that goes, <laughs> What's your spirit animal? Mm, probably a cougar. Ooh. So these offices are gorgeous, and I know that you moved in here, you said last year. How long have you been an attorney? What made you want to become an attorney? I've been an attorney, I guess, uh, about 11 years, and it just I just wanted to know if I could do it, so I did. What's the biggest misconception about attorneys? Um, probably that we're no personality, bookworms, maybe. What's it like working with you with Jimmy Faison? Exciting every day. He's fearless. I love that. So if you weren't an attorney, what would you have done with your life? Probably done something in marketing or sales, something like that. Maybe um, fashion or um, acting. Something fun. What's a song that makes you dance? I don't know. I don't ever know the names of songs. If your life was a song, what would the title be? Uh, let's get it on, I guess. <laughs> so if you're working all the time, are you cooking? Come on in tomorrow. Thank you. Do you eat in or do you eat out? Both. Both. I either go out to restaurants or I order takeout. I don't cook so much. What's your favorite dish to cook? Lasagna. What's your favorite restaurant in town? Mmm, I like El Haluso right now. What's your favorite thing to eat? Italian food. So are you a morning or a night person? Night. What's your current obsession? The sperm. <laughs> do you have any? In fact, I'm going to go check my email. Do you have any head of talents? Uh, I can sew. I'm very domestic. What is something you truly cherish? Ah, uh, my time. What is one thing you could never live without? Probably sunshine. <laughs> What's your favorite place you've ever visited in the world? Hmm. I don't know. I visited lots of nice places, not anything in particular. Where's one place you want to go that you haven't been to? I want to go to Australia and I want to go to Africa. I want to see their animals. What's a pet peeve you have? People who lie or misrepresent things. How would you describe yourself in three words? Um, um, solid, tough, empathetic. If you could have lunch with anyone living or dead, who would it be? Hmm, probably Hillary Clinton. I'd like to know how she endures. What do you have left on your bucket list? Probably a little bit more travel, exciting travel. Where's Bruiser? I don't know where he is. He was just here. He's getting a lot of attention today, so he's probably blowing me off. All right. Well, thank you. Sure. Thanks for coming. Absolutely.